Tom Goodwin said that Uber, the world's largest taxi company, owns no vehicles. Facebook, the world's most popular media owner, creates no content. Alibaba, the most valuable retailer, has no inventory. And Airbnb, the world's largest accommodation provider, owns no real estate. It's also been said that people need banking, but they don't necessarily need banks. And this is true of many industries. As customers, we've become a lot more focused on what we get rather than who we get it from. Established companies with traditional business models have been turned upside down by new entrants who are able to offer better solutions, often highly digitized. And this is called digital disruption. Understanding how this works and why this happens is what you will learn in this course. Plus, we will go through a number of examples and case studies to make it real for you. Digital disruption threatens large firms who have to adapt quickly to stay competitive. Many of them have managed to reinvent themselves, but many have failed. New companies can start up with digital business models that can scale quickly, but larger companies have existing business models that need to change. And the large companies can't just stop what they're already doing and restart in a completely new way. They have to go through what's called digital transformation. They've become big and internally focused, which means they have lost focus on their customer and their needs. So they have to redesign themselves from the outside in. They have to get really focused on what their customers want and then work backwards from that and reinvent themselves. This course is divided into two main sections. Digital disruption in the first section and digital transformation in the second. Now, disruption is all about the impact of technology and transformation is how we are responding to it. So first, we'll look at some case studies, examples of winners, losers and threats. It's important that we learn from how the impact of digital has already played out. Then we will unpack digital disruption in more detail. How it works, what are the principles behind it, how exponential thinking can drive disruptive business models, and why Agile and DevOps is improving the way we work. And finally, we will look at digital transformation. What are the large companies trying to do? And what can we expect to see in the future? Why an innovative culture continues to drive new thinking? Digital talent management. How to attract and retain the best. How to drive successful partnerships between business and IT. Why entrepreneurial thinking is important in large organizations. Disruption starts with you. And self-disruption is the best defense. How to move from disruption to sustainable innovation. So get started with your lessons today. Do the activities and make progress on your goals. Remember to introduce yourself rate and review the course, download the resources, ask questions, and take advantage of all the value we have packaged for you in this course. Also remember to join our exclusive student success community for even more help and a safe space to get the information and updates you need. The Facebook group is a lifeline for help anytime you need it with your studies and in any of our courses. 
when you get your certificate at the end of the course, please do share it on LinkedIn and in your post include the hashtag Peter Alkema. We'll see your post and we'll share it and celebrate in our networks, which will boost your profile and help you grow even more. Also, remember to switch on your email notifications so that you get future updates to the course. We are constantly adding new lessons, making announcements and sharing promotional and educational updates, all of which will continue to help you develop your skills and achieve your goals. So let's get started with your lessons.